Hello you guys, it's Yao. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be taking book trivia quizzes and they are going to test my knowledge on how well do I know books, book titles, book characters, just based on the hints they give me. So yeah, without further ado, let's just get straight into it. Okay, so I've searched up book trivia on BuzzFeed. And I'm going to find a quiz to take. I think I want to try this one first. Only a serious bookworm can guess these book titles with one crucial word swapped out. Okay, this one's easy. Boys. Uh... I think this one is The Haunting of Hill House by Shirley Jackson. Yeah. I have no idea. I think for whom the sandwich tools? I think sandwich should be replaced by bells. Oh. Wow. I did not expect to get that one right. Tinker, Taylor, YouTuber, Spy. Okay, this one, I do not know. Um, just go with... Just go with Ryder. It's wrong, though. Hmm, Tinker, Taylor, YouTuber, Spy. I really don't know. Let's see. Um, maybe it starts with an S because there's two T's. Tinker, Taylor. Let's loop. What starts with an S that's related to this? Tinker Taylor. I don't know. Salesman. I don't want to give up, but all right, I'll just give up. And what is it? Soldier. I could have guessed that. Oh my god! If I kept going. Yeah, two T's and then an S. Okay, um, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. Oh, series of sus events. Unfortunate. Kind of funny. 100 years of, this is solitude. Yep. Hand of Wrath. Guys, this is pretty easy, actually. Just like a couple hard ones thrown in there. Grapes of Wrath. Hate. This is too easy. <laughs> this is way too easy. The Glow Up of Mischief. Okay, I don't know this one. Could be Adventures. What? Do Adventures. Prime, isn't it Prime? Yeah. This is the color purple. Okay. A Song of Pudding and Fire. A song of Flame. No, that's wrong. I don't know for this one. Song of... Alright, what is it? 
give up. Song of Ice and Fire. Oh, I should have guessed that because ice is the opposite of fire. Oh my god. Eat the light. Isn't it at the lighthouse? In the lighthouse. This one's by Virginia Woolf. I think so, yeah. <laughs> All right, what is it? To the, are you kidding me? I literally said something that's very similar to that act. Okay, Search of Lost Socks. I have no idea in Search of Lost Socks. Boys, with Lost Boys from Never <laughs> Um, No, that wouldn't be it. In Search of Lost Souls. Is that it? Okay, I give up. What is it? Lost time. Okay, um... Okay, you guys, I'm gonna finish up this quiz super quickly because I need to pick up food. So, yeah. Half of a yellow anorak. I don't know. Half of a yellow anorak? Is anorak the word that shouldn't be there? Half of a yellow. Yeah, what is it? Oh. What? Okay, would I have to guess that? The CEO of Wildfell Hall. Probably King. Jury. What is it? The tenant. Mm. Okay, so I didn't do that great. Um, I got a 10 out of 17. It says, not bad. You deciphered a few of these, but you still... Uh All right, you guys, I have finished dinner, so I'm going to be taking my second trivia quiz. And this one is, can you identify the iconic book character from the way they are first described? All right, I'm really excited for this one. All right, so the first description, she had a decided mouth, a comical nose, and sharp gray eyes, which appeared to see everything and were by turns fierce, funny, or thoughtful. Her long, thick hair was her one beauty, but it was usually bundled into a nest to be out of her way. Okay, this is from Little Woman. Yeah. That just sounds like a Little Woman description. He was a tall man with powerful shoulders, a fierce dark face, and eyes that seemed to flash and glitter with savage laughter. It was a face to be dominated by or to fight, never a face to patronize or pity. That's not Snape. <laughs> um, okay, it's either Count Dracula or Sherlock Holmes. I'm leading more towards Count Dracula. Oh, guys, I was so confident, <laughs> but it's none of those. It's Lord whoever. Okay. I had all the characteristics of a human being. Flesh, blood, skin hair, but my deep personalization was so intense, had gone so deep that my normal ability to feel compassion had been eradicated. I feel like that's Patrick Bateman from American Psycho. Yeah, it has to be. Yeah, okay. Let's face it. I'm five foot nine, flat chested, and a freshman. How much more of a freak can I... This is from um the Twilight, like, books because like i think there's a meme where it's like how much more of a freak i could i be ah why am i stumbling over my words okay yeah the last one. Oh yeah like from the princess star oh okay i feel like i remember that okay let's see what else 
She had straggly waist length, dirty blonde hair, very pale eyebrows, and protuberant eyes that gave her a permanently surprised look. Oh, I think this is from The Book Thief. Yeah. Definitely not Coraline. Are you kidding me? No. Oh, yeah. That would be my second guess. Okay. He was about six and a half feet tall, judging from his tracks. He dined on raw squirrels and any cats he could catch. That's why his hands were bloodstained. I think this is Boo Bradley. Or the monster from Frankenstein. I'm gonna go with Boo Bradley. Okay, good. His eyes were large and very blue. A young girl's eyes trusting in gullis, but the rest. Her features were broad and coarse, her teeth were Why do I feel like it's Miss Trunchbull? Like when she was younger. It's definitely not right, but I'll just go with that. Yeah, that's wrong. Okay, I have no idea who that lady is, so. He was 96 and a half, and that is just about as old as anybody can be. Like all extremely old people, he was delicate and weak, and throughout the day, he spoke very little. That's... Either Scrooge or Grandpa Joe. It's Grandpa Joe, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay. Last one. She wore a slim, cool black dress, black sandals, and pearl choker. For all her chic thinness, she had an almost breakfast cereal air of health. A soap and lemon cleanness, a rough pink darkening in the cheeks. Um, okay, so it's definitely not the middle two, I feel. Well, actually, I don't know. I think it's the first one. Maybe. Let's just see. Okay. Okay, so five out of nine. Still not too great, but not too shabby either. I don't know. All right. Okay, you guys. Thank you so much for watching and sending you so much love and bye-bye. That's the end of this video.